sheep out and now I'm waiting for them to make their way out back. I do know that I need another panel across this half of the section because the lambs have figured out they can get through this hole right here. So rather than putting them in every single morning when I let the flock out, I am just going to go get another panel and put it across there. But once they all get out back, I need to go and see if I can't get that lawnmower started with the sprayer on it. Um, it just needs in. Um, I, I don't, I don't even have a clue why it wouldn't start after I put the fuel in. So, um, but it was getting dark and I needed to get the sheep in and now that it's daylight, we'll go try it again. that I was able to hit before it died compared to the ones I didn't get. Stuff works fast and doesn't damage the grass at all. Finished up that tank and then sprayed a second tank and then I did lunch and now my daughter just brought me over to get my pickup. So I kind of waited till she came home. It's hot. I didn't really want to walk the half mile back here. Yes, I am that lazy right now. Especially when it's about 90 degrees it's probably only 85 but there is no shade and um, just wasn't feeling it so I puttered around the house got the water started got the water started on the herb garden which I don't know it's not doing great uh, I think it just gets too hot and I can't keep it wet enough. I mean, it, it literally within hours of me taking the water off looks like I haven't put any water on it. So I either need to let it, I either need to let it run and I mean, just saturate it for several hours um, instead of the two and three hours that I normally do or Maybe I just need to run it all night. I'm not sure what to do, but um, yeah. Now I have to go meet him with the pickup to go to town for something. This is the next thing I need to weed, but apparently I really need to water it as well. So when I get home, on this for a couple hours before dark and then tomorrow weed it and throw the water back on it but I gotta run to town first just got back from town feeding dogs and this is what we brought home I believe he is making more jobs for me now I'm not saying we don't need a rake because the ones that we have are not good. I just really would like a mower more. Can't really see it from here, but that baby is flapping his wings and trying to learn how to fly.
Yeah, I didn't think I got everybody in last night. They must have been hiding under the trees because I could not find them anywhere. But it is good to know they brought themselves in. And I'm really glad I shut the gate last night. Hey, sis. What are you doing? What you doing, sister? Come on, girls. Let's go. Now that all the thistles are dying, I really need a mower to come in so that I can come in behind this, mow these all down, and then spray just the root area, and then hopefully they won't come back. Definitely our mower that goes behind our tractor is broke and has been for several years. And I don't think either one of us has really looked at it to see if it's fixable or if it's just one of those things we parked it because we knew we didn't have time for it and we've never gone back to it. So maybe this weekend we got to get past this hay. So this is my project today. I need to find a sprocket. This sprocket, but not messed up. Um, it had one of those stupid little keys in it, so we had to cut it off because the key would not come out. It's like a key lock or something. I can't remember exactly what it's called. I don't know the terminology on things. I know how to take it apart. I know how to put it together, but I don't know what it's called. I know this is a sprocket. Um, so yeah, I need to go find one of these. I'm hoping our local hardware store has one. I'm not banking on it, but that would save me a trip to town. He did leave me the car this morning because I think he knew I was going to have to go to town. So, but I'm going to finish my coffee, watch my sheep, and then we'll go look for this bugger because I've got to get this hay put into bales. Um, it's more than time. Okay, it has been an adventure, but I got the sprocket I needed, I got the bearing I needed, and I even remembered a box of tear bowls. So, let's go home and put this sucker together. Got all the parts and pieces home, and he has to go stack hay. So, um, not really sure where that leaves us. I guess waiting for him to finish stacking so that he can, it kind of takes two people on some of that stuff because we have to lift up the time bar, I guess is what it's called. I don't know. And so maybe it's a roller rack. I don't know. I don't know. I just know what it does, where it is, and how to put stuff on. Somebody needs to lift it, and somebody needs to put the bearing and plate on, and yeah. So, I guess I'm waiting till he gets home, and then he left the dog food that I need to feed the dogs in town in his pickup. So, I'm going to get a hold of my daughter and see if she'll grab it. But, until then... Looks like I'm just going to keep puttering around the yard and get stuff taken care of. Guys, I didn't think I'd get any to hatch. But do you see that one? Can't get my finger in the shot. The third one in. You see it poking? I got a baby hatching. What else I got in there? That one in the corner on the very left side. It's got a big hole in it. And my husband had all of these standing upright, like that one in the back. And look at, they're rolled. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. I didn't think I'd get any. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, well, hopefully by tomorrow I'll have some little peepers.
and I am late getting out here to bring the sheep in because they're all heading right back out uh, right back out so I need to get around them and push them the other direction because it's time to come in yeah you go find some friends go find some food Got a sick little baby he's losing weight and I'm not sure why so brought him up here with these other girls get him on a little bit better feed doesn't have to travel as far get some weight back on him I'll grab some medicine for him in the morning I've got one row done on my garden starting the next row Can't decide if she's protecting the baby bird or about to eat the baby bird. <laughs> 